Hey guys, welcome back. So today I'm going to be doing an Amazon haul. I have a few items that I really want to share with you guys and I'm going to, you know, show you how I'm using the items and just how to use the items. But we're going to jump straight into this video. But before we do, I would love it if you hit that subscribe button. If you're not already subscribed, that'll be so, so awesome. Don't forget to turn on your notification bell so that you're always notified whenever I upload a video. All right, so I'm just going to start off with this first item, which is this water filter. I really need something for my garage fridge it's getting hot outside and I'm gonna like start working out in the in the garage again it was way too cold because the garage isn't like insulated so it's too cold during the winter to be out there trying to work out I would like freeze it up but now that it's getting nice and hot I can go and start you know working out lifting weights in the garage and I really wanted to just get this filter so I'm not running back and forth like in and out of the house just to hydrate all right so this is the filter here guys I just want to show you guys how you're supposed to set it up so it's going to come with this um, cartridge here you do want to remove these caps at the bottom so I have one off already and these caps are called restriction caps so that's pretty much how fast you want your water to filter the plus is if you wanted to filter fast let me see if I can zoom in on it so yeah you see the plus sign if you wanted to filter fast then you turn it to the plus sign but if you wanted to filter more thoroughly you will just have it at the minus sign but if you wanted to filter as fast as possible just remove the caps um, all together you don't need the caps on there if you're just trying to get it to you know filter super fast but I'm gonna keep mine on just dropped one but when you get it you do want to wash it I already washed my um, tank and everything but with this one you want to soak it in some water for about 15 minutes so I'm just gonna leave that there so it's been about 15 minutes I'm just gonna rinse this for about 10 seconds All right so that in and you're gonna put it in the chamber and push it in there guys make sure it's nice and snug push it in and then you're just gonna fill it with some water and it is recommended to um, dump the water three times before actually using this all right so I'm done with that I just put the lid on and it has this indicator on the top so you're just going to hit start just press it down for about three seconds and it's going to come on and you want to do that when you fill your picture for the first time you want to you know press it hold it down so it can let you know the life of your filter it lets you know when you need to like change it out um, it says to replace it after 60 days so you have the 60 days on there and it's just going to count down to zero. When it hits zero, you want to replace the filter and the percentage like the bars on here. That's going to tell you the percentage of the filter's life. So I guess once that reaches no bars, then you want to replace your filter. So it just depends on how you use it, like how often you're using it. Now the next item is going to be this nail organizer, but I plan to use this for my daughter's hair accessories because she has so many. It's really nice because you have two sides so you can open it and you know you can fill it with whatever you need. These are pretty uh, good size compartments so it's not like super tiny you can't put anything in here. I can like you know give it to my son for his toys, his cars fits perfectly in this and you can flip it on this side, turn it, um, open it on this side, turn it over and also open it on this side as well. So you have two different sides. It's really great oh and you can resize the accessory compartments I did not know that so let's see so you can just resize this accessory compartment you have dividers that you can take out and just resize like this you can put stuff here like you can just play around with it something like this would be really great for people that's into crafting you can put like crafting supplies in here so yeah I really like this a lot it's very versatile because you do have like you know these compartments that are pretty spacious um, you cannot resize the compartments um, you have to leave those as is but this is a really great item for just staying organized all right so the next item is this um, silk plant treatment so this is going to just clean your faux plants and I really like this product guys it works so well I'm gonna show you in a second but 
I was just browsing like a uh, faux plant cleaner on Amazon and came across this. And I do recommend you guys do this outside or in your garage because this stuff sprays out like water, okay? So it's gonna be like dripping and you don't want to ruin your floors. So um, if you have to do it inside, then just put something down. Or if you like doing like a small plant or something, then just, you know, put something down, put a rag down and then, you know, spray away. But all you have to do is spray and walk away. It works that well. I'm gonna show you guys right now. All right, so I'm in the garage right now. Sorry if the video looks kind of grainy. I don't know why it's doing that because it is daylight. So for some reason, my camera isn't like picking up good quality. But anyways, I'm gonna just spray it. This is the untreated side of this plant. As you can see, it's super dusty and old. And then this is the side that was treated. You see the difference? You see how shiny it is? So nice, right? Let me show you how it works, guys. So all you have to do is spray. It sprays like water, guys. You see that? It's dripping. And that's what you want. You want it to be dripping because that is how it gets all of the dust off and it just makes it look really nice. All of this stuff is just gonna drip off. So you don't have to go back and wipe it or anything. You just spray it down. All of this stuff is gonna drip off and just let it dry. And it's just gonna look so nice. I have a lot of, you know, full plants, flowers in my home because I cannot keep real like flowers alive. Um, I used to buy like the real plants, like the big house plants, but, um, I haven't been purchasing any lately because like I said, you know, I cannot keep them alive for too long. So I just get the fake ones, like call it a day, whatever. But the fake plants, you know, it will collect dust. Your house will be super dusty with them. So this is really great. All right. So the next thing I want to show you guys is this motion sensor lights i got this because you know um when it's dark and the kids are trying to come downstairs i don't have to worry about them falling or like even if i need to come downstairs at night i don't want to have to turn on the overhead lights and it's not going to come on all day whenever it senses motion it only comes on at night just like right now you know i'm near it there's motion and it's not coming on because it's so bright in the house it knows like you know you know, it's daytime, but it comes on when the house is dark. It is battery operated, and that's really good with this being battery operated. So it's not going to just be draining the battery by coming on all day long. And it did have adhesive on the back, so you can just stick it to the wall. But, you know, my kids, they just, they cannot leave stuff alone at all. They peeled it off. <laughs> so I just have it sitting up here like that. I can always just go back and put double-sided um, double sided tape on it. Um, and it also comes with screws, but I'm not going to, you know, screw this into the wall. I could just, you know, sit it there. It's a pack of three, so I have them, like, going up the stairs. You know, I have one there and at the very top. But, um, yeah, I really like this. I love that it doesn't come on all day long. It only comes on at night. And it stays on for about maybe 10 seconds, and it'll cut back off until it senses motion again. So I really like it. Pack of three, really affordable. And since we're on my stairs, I guess I can go ahead and mention this runner that I found on Amazon as well. Um, I did go and like transform my staircase. So if you're new to my channel, yeah, I did do this myself before I had like some really dirty um, carpet. Like, you know, it was here when we moved in and it was just trashed. It was in really bad shape. So I ripped it out. I painted the treads and the riser and then I added this runner and what I love so much about it is you can customize the size. So this is one runner. I was able to just, you know, get it to the length that I wanted it. And that's what I really love about it. So I didn't have to do any cuts or like match up anything. I just had it going straight down. It was just so easy to do. But yeah, if you're new to my channel and you want to see this transformation, I will have a link in the description box because it was really easy. So with this style, um, the runner, you have your Greek key, which is my favorite print. And you do have different colors, but it is going to come with like these like um spots of gray throughout the runner and that's just the design i like it i have no issues with it i think it's really nice but yeah you you can um, pick different colors as well all right so the next thing i want to share is this veggie wash i've been using this for years and i really love it i think it does a really good job just um cleaning your vegetables you know getting that wax off especially with apples 
this does a really good job with just getting that wax um, wax off of it so I definitely recommend this I have no issues with it like I said I've been using it for years and then I have this here decided to go ahead and purchase this for cleaning my blinds I think it is great I love it and you do get two and it comes with refills so I like it because instead of just doing one at a time let me come over here it's probably gonna get dark but instead of just doing one at a time you can get two two at a time before I would just clean one at a time front back take me forever but with this it's just so easy to just you know get it clean I love it <laughs> so I do believe well this yeah I guess I can show you guys I'm not gonna set this up right now but I guess I can still show you so this is a mount for your DVR let me see if they have a picture um not really let me see if i can get close up so it's a mount for like your dvr or dvd player i don't know whatever you need to mount or like your game system so that's why i purchased this because i do want to take my um dvr off of my console and just like only have the tv there but i do need to have somebody come out and like run my wires through the wall in order to do this so yeah i went ahead and just picked this up because you know my girl katie was showing this in her stories and i went and purchased it like immediately because this is a really good idea so yeah you just like set it up and your box is going to sit inside and you just put it on the wall yeah so hopefully this works hopefully it's not i do believe my tv is big enough to completely cover it but that's the plan but like i said i would need someone to come out and like run some wires so the cords aren't like still hanging down but yeah that's what i plan to do with this so yeah these are all of my amazon finds that i wanted to share I will have everything linked in the description box. All right, so that's going to be it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed watching. Again, if you're not already subscribed, I would love it if you do so. That would be so, so awesome. And um, if you did enjoy watching, give this video a thumbs up. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.